details here of this subject. And so I thought, let me look at this vertical format and does that work? So I've got about, this is divided into thirds. That's a good compositional thing. Um, I've got, you know, a path leading to my subject. I don't know. I'm not sure about that. Um, so I tried a horizontal format and now I think the tree got truncated. So pardon the pun, but I think that didn't give the tree enough importance. Then I tried one more and this one I thought worked because I really loved the footprints in the snow. If you can see them in the original photo. Um, I loved that, that kind of human touch in this cold dramatic landscape. So um, I kind of got a little bit maybe in love with those footsteps too much. And I did an interim drawing. I'm going to show you that now. So I did an interim drawing. Not quite finished, but as I was drawing it, I thought I wasn't listening to my own advice because what is the subject here? What was it that I really wanted to paint? And it was that magnificent maple tree. So what I'm doing here is because I just fell in love with these footprints, I minimized my subject at the cost or at the cost of my subject. I, I emphasized those footprints. So I decided I really need to rethink this, all of this space up in the foreground, and make this a much bigger part of my painting. So let's do that just quickly. And this is how I would do a a, a sketch and you're just looking at this point for kind of the big shapes so I've got my tree and now I can really make it a lot bigger and that tree those nice branches that that cut across um, kind of unify the painting at the top and then I can use my footprints to kind of lead the eye to that trunk and I think that this now is a much more um, appropriate composition for this particular image so let me show you, I did go ahead and do a separate drawing of that. And I'm going to pull that drawing up and you can see it. So now I've got my tree is more of my main subject and I've got my, my footprints leading up to that subject. So I think this is working pretty well and minimizing some of that, that large blank space in the foreground. 